Also on the ballot in Pierce County, voters will decide the next sheriff. Six candidates are running after current sheriff Ed Troyer did not seek re-election. Farah Jadwin's live in Puyallup. Farah, we know that some of the candidates are sheriff's appointment employees. What can you tell us about the other people who are running? Well, Mimi and Jake, there's a former Seattle Police Department captain, a federal police sergeant, and as you said, some Pierce County Sheriff's employees, four current and former. So six people on the ballot hoping to become the next sheriff here in Pierce County. Here's a look at all six candidates right now. Patty Jackson, Keith Swank, Cindy Vajardo, Craig Gaucher, Darren Harris, and Mike Scapo. Out of that crowded field, we're going to take a look at the four candidates who have raised the most money for their campaigns leading up to this primary election day. Let's start with Craig Gaucher. He started at the Yakima Police Department almost 20 years ago before serving with Puyallup Police and then working for the Pierce County Sheriff's Department for about five years before going into the private sector. He also serves with the Washington National Guard. Gaucher says he's ready to talk to citizens, let them ask him hard questions and make connections in the community. Next, Cindy Fajardo, who who's been with the Pierce County Sheriff's Department for 36 years and is currently a detachment commander. She's also a leader with the Washington Task Force. She actually ran against Sheriff Ed Troyer for this position back in 2020. Fajardo says curbing youth violence will be a top priority for her. Patty Jackson is currently on the executive team with the Sheriff's Department, serving as the chief of patrol. She started with the department 35 years ago. Jackson said department accountability and overall community safety is most important to her. Finally, Keith Swank was a captain with the Seattle Police Department. He worked there for more than 30 years in SWAT and other roles. He's also an Army veteran. He says focusing on keeping violent criminals from being released and addressing youth crimes are his top priorities. If you want to hear from those four candidates, we did interview them recently. We have that for you on King5.com, including information about all six candidates candidates on the ballot. Live in Puyallup, Farah Jadron, King 5 News.